A Candlelit Christmas is a 2022 film directed by Robert Vaughan and it's written by Ricky Castaneda and Megan Hawking and this stars Nazneen Contractor as Ellie and Mikey Selkin as Logan. We also have Sugith Varugis as Jamar. I apologise if I'm mispronouncing any of these names. And I mentioned Jamar particularly because I really loved the character. This is Ellie's father and there was just something about him that I, I really liked whenever he was on screen. Um, definitely my, my favourite character. Not that there's anything wrong with our romantic leads, but for me, he was the standout. Ellie goes home for Christmas and she goes home to spend time with her father who runs a, a candle making business. And every year her mother would make these special Christmas candles. Her mother sadly passed away and her father just can't seem to get the Christmas candles right. There seems to be a, an ingredient that he's missing, but he can't quite work out what it is. And part of the film is Ellie trying to find out what's missing uh, and make these candles and create the scent that her mother used to do every Christmas. And Logan, who is, is staying with her father, um, he's a writer and he decides to help out. And I think that works really well He's as he's very inquisitive, as writers often are, speaking as a writer, and his his need to find out these answers and there's this mystery surrounding these candlestick holders as well, makes it a really good pairing. They have different motivations, but they're working towards the same end goal. And I think they work really well together as a romantic pairing. I think they work really well. The on-screen chemistry is really realistic, really believable. I'm very happy with that part of the film. However, I will say, I didn't really find that I, I cared, which sounds a bit mean, but I wasn't emotionally invested in the story. I hoped the best for everybody, but I just wasn't that interested in, in the story. I wasn't that bothered about finding out what this missing ingredient was or the history behind these candlesticks. I just didn't care. And sometimes that happens. Sometimes with Christmas rom-coms, if there's a mystery like this, I'm fully behind it and I'm desperate to know the answers. But with this one, I just wasn't. But the characters are likeable enough and there's a decent amount of Christmas in it that I was interested in the other aspects of the film. So the specifics of the narrative, I didn't really care about. But everything else, it was not too bad. So some likeable characters, decent amount of festivities that it does feel like a Christmas film. And the candle aspect was... It was interesting enough, the process behind making them I thought was quite fascinating, but not enough for me, as I said, to become really emotionally invested in the journey that the characters were going on. So it's okay, it's not my favourite, but I didn't mind watching it, and if it sounds like your kind of film, then I'd say it's worth checking out. I think some people might like it more than I did, which is absolutely fine, of course, but for me, it was okay. I certainly didn't mind it, and I'm happy enough to recommend it.